What is going on Drive2 crew? Ramdi here with a brand new Fortnite drawing tutorial. And as you guys can see with my two Peely action figures here, we are gonna be drawing Peely from season eight of Fortnite. So let's go ahead and get started. Now Peely, whether you like bananas or not, uh, whether you like Fortnite or not, I find Peely to be such an awesome looking character. Um, he just fits so well with any of my action figures. He's just so much fun. I mean, look at him, he's a banana. He's a banana. And it says Nana Nana here in the back. It says that here as well. And I decided to get two of them because, I mean, look at him. It's, it's just such a cool looking banana. Anyway, I'm very excited for this. So let's go ahead and get started. Now, we can't really draw a circle like we usually do because it's a banana. And uh, so let's go and just kind of start making a shape. And you want that shape to be like... But then I don't know how many times I'm going to say that today, you guys. So I'm going to start here at the top and you kind of want to curve in and then curve out. So you want that little curve right here for the head and then a curve out. And this is going to be where the stomach kind of is. So that curves in, curves out just like that. Okay. Now you want to give him a little bit of an attitude. So what you want to do is you want him to lean this way a little bit more. So I'm going to draw that like that here's the shoulder and then it gets tiny it gets super tall up here i might even in frame let's uh make sure so it gets kind of skinny up here and then we're going to draw a little bit of a circle right at the top there i think we're still in frame there you go okay so there's our uh beginning stage of our peely now it's very important you guys get this shape right um again you know draw this little curve a little stomach sticking out here and here you kind of want to draw it parallel to that this right here you don't really need to worry about how it curves we're gonna add legs to that later on you want to make sure you leave some room here for the legs and over here somewhere we're gonna draw the arms so if I divide this that's sort of where I want the um, the arms to be and this is where like this area right here is where I want the head the face to be at okay now I'm going to divide this into about like three so here you go actually smaller area here larger over here in the middle and then another smaller area if you guys know what i mean okay and then i'm going to start right here i'm going to just curve so you guys can see this is what we're drawing we're drawing the center line going down and this is going to act as the center of our of our uh, drawing here so it's going to go like that and then this is going to be the side and you want this to just go down Pretty much straight down like that this goes all the way up like so now don't be like me you guys i'm kind of drawing it a little too dark for my liking but that's because i'm trying to make sure that you guys can see it in uh on the camera here but make it easier on yourselves by drawing a lot more lightly when you are starting out that way when you get to the final part when you start erasing things uh, it won't leave such a dark mark okay so there's our beginning part of our um, banana banana man here you go i just I, I enjoy this guy so much you guys you guys have no idea okay anyway i'm gonna draw a line right here and another line right here i'm gonna curve it and that's one thigh and that's gonna be this thigh okay let me move this up so you guys can see better now i'm gonna bring this one a little bit lower down i'm gonna start right here actually and i'm gonna first of all i'm going to draw where I want those legs to be so it goes like that and then this goes straight down so give him a little bit of an attitude with his legs sort of leaning like so okay okay let's go here now bring it down and you want to bring it down about this low so a lot lower than this other knee here curve it and then bring it up like that okay now we're going to draw the leg and the leg is going to be we're going to draw the uh this part right here first you got the calf muscle. So here's the knee. I'm going to draw a circle for the knee. You guys can see uh, it's actually diamond shaped, but we'll draw it as a circle for now. This goes down. This goes, this curves outward and then down. Okay, right around here. And then stick out, go down, and then round this like that. And then we're going to just draw this one going down. It goes wide and then narrow that and then mine's gonna go really close to the bottom here but it goes wide 
and then just curve like so. Okay, so there's so there's our there's our peely legs. We're gonna go up here, we're gonna draw a shoulder right around here. And then the shoulder, same thing on this side, like so. Okay. This goes like that for the bicep. This is gonna go this way actually. So we're gonna see his elbow kind of right around here. So I'm gonna draw a line going across like that for the elbow. This goes like so, and then I'm gonna bring that like that. Okay, so there's one arm, here's the other. Forearm, this goes wide and then narrow again. Okay, there's the forearm, and this one, you want that forearm to kind of make a V shape. Actually, start right here. Wide, go wide, and then narrow, narrow, going up. Okay, and then right kind of where the um, shoulder is that we're going to cut it off right there. And there you go. So there's that. And we're going to draw the hand. Hand is going to go out like so. This one goes out like this. I'm going to draw this one like a circle. This one like that. And then we're going to, from here, from the top of that circle or that oval there, and just draw a line like this. So this is going to be one hand. And then the thumb is going to go out like so. May have done that a little too fast, you guys, but uh, yeah, feel free to pause the video, make sure that you guys get it right. Okay. Now, we're up here at the top, we're going to make sure we get those curves right. So I'm just trying to get my lines right here. And this one's a little more straight now. There we go. Okay, and then it goes up to the top like this. I'm going to draw this one like a pentagon, like that. And then I'm going to draw the sides right here, so double up so that you guys can see. Kind of looks like a pentagon-ish. Actually, it looks more like a hexagon, but oh well. Is it a hexagon? No, it's an octagon. Well, there you go. And, okay, so that's that, you guys. We're going to... Uh, cut to commercial right now, then we're going to zoom in and start working on the details for Peely. And in the meantime, you guys check out this commercial and we'll get right back. Hey guys, this video right here is brought to you by these awesome Patreon patrons. If you are interested in knowing more about how to support this channel through Patreon, check out the link down below, patreon.com slash draw it to for more details. Anyway, let's uh, cut to commercial and then let's get back to business. All right, you guys, we are back and let's continue from where we left off. Now we've got uh, I've zoomed in and what we're going to do is we're going to draw the face. And what I'm doing here is making sure that we got the lines right. Remember this right here. Now you can have different faces on Peely. You can draw this face if you want to, but this is the face that I'm going to draw. So I'm, go I'm going to find the spots for the eyes first. And this is right here. We had these lines initially. We're going to draw the lines or we're going to start with those lines, that line is going to be the top of the eye, and it's going to be an oval like this, and it partly sticks out of the banana, as you guys can see. Okay, and the, the other part is going to be right here, and it's going to be kind of to the edge of the, uh, see how it's really close to this edge right here? That's what we're going to do. So we're going to have that eye to the edge of that line there. Fix that up. There you go. So there's our peely eyes. Of course, we're going to add some some sheen to them, to, some shine to make them look nice and shiny. Okay, right here, like that, and then right here. Okay, and then kind of a uh, you see how here you've got some half moon shapes. That's what we're going to try to do. I don't know if you guys can see that very well here. But we're going to draw some half moon crescent shapes. Actually, they're not half moon, they're quarter moon shapes. So there and there. Now this one kind of looks like a happy face right there. But uh, yeah, so now we're going to color it in just the outside part of those, uh, those circles in that half moon. So I'm going to color that in. I'm going to use my other pencil, the one that's already dull. Just 
get those as best as you can. There you go. And then go back with your sharp pencil and just try to get those edges correct. And there we are. Okay, now the, the smile is going to be going right down the center, just like this one, just like that one. And it's going to be going across, down, down. And then you see a little tongue or something like that. It curves up like that. And then just shade in the top part. And there you go. Pretty, pretty awesome. Now, as you guys can see with these two figures, uh, you have a peel that's starting to peel on this side and this one's kind of going down. So let's work on those. I'm gonna start off with this one first and I'm gonna start above the eye, right around here. I'm gonna draw a line that goes curving down about that distance. So you wanna make sure that this distance right here looks like it covers the top. Okay, this goes like that. And I'm gonna start right here as well and bring this up, bigger curve and a down like so. Okay, there you go. I'm gonna double up on this line right here. Bring it across, bring it up. So you've got the yellow peel and then the white flesh, excuse me, the white flesh in the middle. And that line right here, so it looks, kind of looks like a tongue. And that's it, that's pretty good. Okay, right here I'm going to draw two lines because you see a little bit of the uh, the side here. That's like the, the peel and then here's the flesh in here. And with the flesh we're going to add a little texturing to it. You guys, I don't know if you guys can see that. Where am I? There we go. You guys can see little some lines going across like a banana and then some lines going down like a banana. And there you go. And then this one is not so hard. This one goes up to around here. So I'm going to draw a curve like this first and then bring it down. Double up to two lines. Like this. And goes like that. There we go. Okay, let's add some texturing over here. I'm just going to draw lines going up and then lines going down like that. The little like V shapes, little triangular shapes here just to give it some texture. And then right here, just lines going up and down. And there. So there's our peely face. Now let's draw the body. Well, we did draw the body already. That's what the body looks like. But anyway, let's draw the arms and how the arms attach to the the the, uh, the figure itself and it kind of has like this ring around the arm like this kind of around the shoulder and here we have the shoulder just giving it a little bit of shape erasing some bits of it bring that up okay so here is the shoulder you guys notice that the way I've drawn it, it's a little bit more angular and that's on purpose. Okay, so now I'm gonna draw a line going down the bicep and these lines sort of act as a, a way to show that he's got like a, some muscle definition as well. Goes like that and this goes towards the center like so. So there's, there's one arm right there. Now let's bring it all the way down. Let's start drawing the, uh, the hands. And I'm gonna draw the oval for the thumb, like this part of the thumb right here. Thumb goes like that. Okay, this goes out. And this is gonna be the index finger, like so. Okay, and then one, two, three. Just make sure you get that index finger first. And then here's a knuckle, and I'm going to bring that up to there. Okay, so we drew a knuckle here. This is actually going to be a finger going across like that. And the rest of the fingers, you don't see much of them. They just go behind the thumb like so. Um, I know I rushed through the hands, you guys. 
but like I say a lot, um, you could do an entire tutorial on just the hands because it is a very complicated part of the body to draw. So the problem is you can't do that if you are drawing a full body to uh, doing a full body tutorial on a figure. You can't just, you know, spend 45 minutes on the hand, for example, because that's how long it takes sometimes. That's why I speed it up and I apologize if that's frustrating. There you go. So there's the uh, one hand right there. Let's go to the other, other arm. Okay, so let's shape it. Just um, getting my shape right here. Okay, this goes across. See a little bit of a, uh, yeah, we'll just leave it like that. Okay, so there's that there's the forearm you got a line going through the forearm like this now the elbows are they've got like flat bits to them so that's what this is right here you don't see it on this side just on this side though and here there you go okay let's draw the hand kind of drew the thumb already so here's the thumb we drew this part of the hand now you want to draw this going across like this. Okay, and then we'll just draw the individual fingers. One finger goes out like this, the other one goes this way. The middle finger is longer than this finger, so you want to bring that up. And then this one has a bit of a curve. Okay, so that's the ring finger. And then the fourth finger, what you want to do is you want it to stick forward. So here's where it sticks forward right there and then just bring it to that side, to the side there. And it's just, what you're trying to accomplish is just him kind of having his hand like this. So you see how this kind of sticks forward and these are sticking out mostly. That's what we're trying to do here. And then just draw some of those lines there that you see on the finger. And that's pretty much it. It's again, you guys, we're not spending way too, we're not spending too much time on these. Um, and there you go. Zooming out, we're just going to make sure that we get the shape here as best as we can. And I'm going to bring this up slightly. There you go. So the key is to try to get as smooth a shape as possible. There you go. Okay, so we're almost done. Let's work on the legs. And let's work on this leg first. I'm gonna use this right here. I'm gonna draw the diamond shaped um, knees first. So you see that diamond shape over there. You see it over here as well. And it's kind of got like this curve inwards, it sort of spirals in like that, and it's got a bit of an edge like this. Okay, and the leg sort of shapes into it, inverted lines like that. And then this right here goes like this. I'm gonna draw that one a little bigger. Okay, it goes down. Now I'm gonna draw this center line right here going all the way to the ankle once you get to the ankle I'm going to kind of figure out this is going to be the boot part so here's our here's our foot right this goes this way and this goes down this goes diagonal and then this goes forward and down and that's going to be our the back and the front of the boot there or whatever you want to call his footwear okay we're gonna now going to draw the sole, which is brown. And then we're going to divide this. Okay, so the center part, if you guys can see here, the center sticks out. So let's draw that. So we have this line going down, we're gonna draw it forward like so. Okay, and then just a little line like this, so it looks like this part is sticking out. 
Now bring it all the way down, actually. There you go. Okay, and then we'll do the same thing on this side. Whoa. Zooming out slightly, I'm grabbing a new pencil. Now, let's figure out how these uh, legs connect to the body. And this right here actually makes a flat shape, like so, like a straight shape, and then this curves. in and then towards the towards the uh, knee pad like that okay and then right here I'm going to draw like this line right here it sort of comes out like that okay now I'm going to draw the diamond shape knee like this now this center line kind of goes like that making that thigh a little bit wider continuing on here we have an ankle so you want to leave a little bump there okay, and you want to follow the center Okay, and then there, it sort of divides this way and this way. Okay. You've got the sole right here. And then that goes across like that. Okay, and then just close off the sides, fix it up. And we are done. So here's our Peely. Let's zoom out. I think he's going to be a little too big for the picture for the uh, for our screen here. But there's Peely, you guys. There you go. I think it might be a little too tall, but that's okay. I'm not worried about it. I hope you guys enjoyed this Fortnite tutorial. Uh, it's been a while since I did a Fortnite character. Let me know in the comment section if there's any more Fortnite characters you guys like. Or if you guys still play Fortnite, if you guys are looking forward to the next season. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Take care. And you guys, that is all the time that we have for this video. Thank you so much for tuning in all the way to the very end. I appreciate that a lot. If you guys are proud of your drawings, I would love to see them. So head on over to Instagram, tag me at draw to so I can see your masterpieces. If you guys are ever curious about the tools that I use for drawing or the equipment that I use to make these videos, I have links in the description of this video. So make sure you guys check that out. If you are feeling extra generous, I have links down in the description as well for different ways that you can show your support on this channel. I already mentioned Patreon, but there are other ways as well. So be sure to check those out. Links in the description. Your contributions go a long way in ensuring that I can continue making videos just like this for you guys to enjoy free of charge. Again, if you guys like this video, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like this video right here, comment down below and share this with your friends in your social media. And speaking of social media, don't forget you guys can find me on Instagram, on Facebook, and of course on my website, draw2.com, where you can find a free coloring page based on the tutorial drawing that is found in this video. Again, you guys, all of the links to those are found in the description of this video. So be sure to check that out. Finally, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. And uh, yeah, stay tuned for more so you can learn to draw it too. I'll see you guys next time.